See if this shows up on camera. Hey YouTube, this is Prep Pro 2717. Sorry about the video, I'm recording audio only. I uh, hope it doesn't sound too horrible. So while I'm talking, I needed to give you something to watch, and who doesn't love fuzzy little puppies? Basically, I was just sitting here with my wife, and while I was watching some videos, I came across something that I thought was worth taking a few minutes to talk about. Uh, and that's OPSEC, or Operation Security. Uh, you usually hear about it when someone wants to put someone else down for trying to help other people by putting putting out videos of their food storage or gun collection or their emergency plan. Um, this isn't going to be a how-to video uh, where I explain the do's and don'ts. I just hope that this video will cause you to think a little bit about uh, what we're all sharing with each other and how that might affect you and your family. I'll start by saying that uh, every one of us who puts videos on YouTube are guilty of violating OPSEC. Uh, rule number one about Fight Club is you don't talk about Fight Club. Uh, some of us make videos because we're egomaniacs that are dying for attention and want everyone and anyone to look at me and look what I have and look what I could do. Some of us just haven't thought too much about the potential risks. And then there's uh, those of us who are just trying to get some information out to people that hopefully could help them. Uh, there are a lot of great channels on YouTube uh, that have tons of information, and I know I've learned a lot from watching the videos that you guys post. So thanks for that. Uh, there is some inherent risks involved with making some of these videos, and some people are perfectly comfortable with showing their mugs in their videos or their food storage, guns, and even their families. I guess we could all, you know, disguise our voices, wear masks, and just explain the information without showing anything, but I'll be the first to admit that I'd be less likely to follow someone's advice if I can't see them using the skills or techniques they're trying to, trying to describe. Uh, I choose to not show my face on YouTube. I just never really have. Uh, my Facebook account is only open to my friends and family, and that's... That's just the way my wife and I approach social media, and I don't really see that changing anytime soon. There are less than a handful of guys even here on YouTube that even know my first name. Um, I'm 99% sure that if I did show my face and share my name, that it would be no big deal, but with a wife, three kids, and two foster kids, I just can't be wrong that 1% of the time. Uh, there are a few channels the, that I follow pretty regularly, and I recently watched a video from a great channel who always has some useful information, and this is kind of the purpose of why I'm making this video now. Um, while I was watching this video, I started to pick up on a few seemingly minor details that were being said and some things in the background of the video. I feel like I'm pretty observant. And for a while, it was my draw. It was my job to track people down. And based on what was said and what I saw, I had his. I had this guy's home address in li literally about two minutes. Um, I don't know if anyone else noticed what I did, but it prompted me to PM this guy and suggest that he remove the video and edit out the information that made it so easy to find him. Um, I don't know if it was just something that he overlooked or if he doesn't care if people know where he lives, but I felt he should know uh, that he may have been a little careless in this particular video. So I hope we can all learn from this situation. Thankfully it wasn't a huge deal and no one, as far as I know, um, was hurt by it. Uh, but the reality is that there are some really solid people out there, but there are also knuckleheads running around. Uh, so the next time you guys make a video, check and double check that you didn't inadvertently sweep your license plate or um, your home address or mention something that maybe you shouldn't have. Uh, just please be safe and take a few minutes to think about what you're putting out there and protect your family. So um, thanks so much for watching. Rate this video. I'd love to hear your comments uh, and subscribe if you if you haven't already. 
and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.